This is our my my second construction project of the weekend. Uh, this is Camper Civic 2.0. <laughs> camper Civic, if you don't know, is uh, I'm converting my car to work as a camper at the racetrack, which I love. And I've always wanted to have my own place at the racetrack. What I want is a sprinter van. That's not happening yet. Uh, but in the meantime, I went down this rabbit hole on YouTube of people who turn their Civics and their Honda Fits and all these little tiny cars into campers. So I figured if they can do it, I can do it. So I've had some fun with this. Here, let's take a look. All right, so let's start with Camper Civic version 1.0. Here you can see the original platform. Uh, and I apologize for the, <laughs> for the mess in the trunk. And uh, need some vacuuming here. But the only way, the original platform here I built uh, was to have me sitting, sleeping there in the back seat with both the front seats still in the car. And uh, my feet would go in through the hole in the back here. And uh, I found out through this process that that hole through the back seat, as you can see, is not as big as it looks. And when my legs were in there, it was really, really cramped and I had a hard time rolling over. Uh, so I decided that I was going to take version uh, 1.0. Here you can see uh, I built this. And usually, thankfully, I was able to use the same platform. I was a little worried that I'd have to redo the whole platform again. So uh, I didn't have to do that. I was able to repurpose the platform and, uh, and bring it into the front seat. Uh, the legs are from the original platform as well. Uh, and now you can see this hole is still to the back seat. Uh, my feet will go back into that area, but just my feet now, nothing else. Uh, you can see up front there I have the uh, the two mattresses. I also have some pipe insulation that I put up on the front there uh, to to protect the car uh, from you know any kind of scraping uh, of the wood, you know, as far as the dashboard and, and the passenger seat or the passenger door. So uh, my mattress right now is a yoga mat and a camping mat uh, for sleeping on the ground when you're tent camping. I'm going to be getting some like a memory foam type, like a mattress topper. I'm going to use that as my mattress. I think that's going to be the next step with this. So uh, the best part about this is now I've got even more room for storage um, for my cooler, my camp stove, my table, my chair, uh, my cooking supplies, my clothes, obviously, my TV and camera equipment. Uh, so this is going to be really, really good for going to the racetrack. Um, I already know a couple of changes I'm going to make here. Uh, I'm going to, uh, underneath the seat there, you can see all that storage space. So there's a ton of useful space there, but it's a little hard to get to. I'd have to have really tiny stuff to put in there. So I'm going to put a, uh, uh, an access point there through the top. And also in the back seat there, I just want to add that piece of wood there, uh, to protect the back seat. So, uh, kind of cool. I uh, really think that's, uh, going to be a nice little addition here. Uh, to Camper Civic 2.0. Uh, I'll do a video from the racetrack this weekend. I've got two nights in Camper Civic, and uh, we'll see how it all goes. And I'll also show you how I pack all the stuff in there and everything I take with me on a race weekend. Uh, so that's all for now. This is Camper Civic 2.0, uh, my latest construction project, my ongoing construction project, and I'm um, having fun making things. So uh, if you want to give me some suggestions about what I should make next, uh, just put them in the comment section. And uh, also, it would be great if you would uh, subscribe and like uh, and, and click the bell for notifications for the next video. That would be fantastic. Hope you all have a great day and go out and make stuff.